welcome to the grand opening of the Shelby Township Activity Center. I'm here with the man who really is at the center of it all, Joe Youngblood. Joe, this is a huge day. You've just got to feel ecstatic. It is. It's a huge day. Kelly, thanks for coming out and showing off our beautiful building that we have here in Shelby Township. Uh, the Shelby Township Activity Center, this has been a long time coming. Yeah. Uh, it's amazing to offer a first class facility for our residents of Shelby Township. And this is for all ages. We have the senior center hours, but then after that we have programming for everyone. Once we've had people through this week kind of getting a sneak peek and they're leaving, uh, biggest smile on their face. They can't believe how beautiful it is. So we're very excited. And even just the little touches. I was saying to the crew as we were walking through two weeks ago, three weeks ago when we were here, you were like, okay, we're getting ready, we're getting ready. And I'm thinking, this isn't, I'm like afraid for you. This is nowhere <laughs> near ready. But wow, yeah. I mean, it's not just ready, it feels homey in here yes. with all the little touches. And that's what I think that people, when they see here, um, any, every community needs a place to come together, bring the community together, and we have the sports end of it, but we also have a place, just come here, have a coffee, talk to people, relax. Every room has something unique and different. But yeah, we did. I'd like to thank our staff uh, uh, from our rec staff, the senior staff, and our maintenance staff for pulling it off the last few weeks, uh, getting everything together. They have done an amazing job. And also, of course, special thanks to our township board for seeing the vision that we had. And, and they were here yesterday and they were blown away by how beautiful it turned out. Now, what is your favorite part of it, of the activity center? Well, being a sports guy my whole life, it's always been the gym. But mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, there's other things that are getting up there, that, like the room one, the lounge. I'm like, how awesome is this? You know, yeah. the, the furniture, the layout, the TV, the, the place for people to come and, and uh, recreate in a leisurely activity and just, and then you go down the hall, I could go on and on and on. Each, each day I come in, I go, I have a new favorite room. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say these chairs are my favorite. I I'm going to be kicking I back later. I can't argue with that, Kelly. <laughs> they are very comfortable. Well, thank you so much for having us, and congratulations on such a successful opening. Thank you, Kelly. Thanks for coming out, and can't wait to see all of our residents uh, out here soon enjoying this beautiful facility. It's a great day for Shelby Township. You know, we've expanded, actually increased square footage. We had 11,000 square feet for the senior citizens. Now we've got a 25,000 square foot building for all kinds of activities. We have a basketball court. We've never had that before. An expanded cafeteria with a stage. Um, or just everything you need. Uh, all kinds of games, a games room, um, eight acres for baseball. We've got a brand new baseball field, a nice little soccer field. So, you know, we spent three and a half million dollars for all of this instead of eight and a half that we were thinking about spending. And what's even better is we paid for it in cash, no bonding, no borrowing. And we would have done it uh, the other way too with cash, but this is much better. Um, and we took a lot of the money that we might have spent on the activity center and put it into roads. So this township is much better off. And I'm so glad that Joe Youngblood had this vision actually 10 years ago. He's been, he's been eyeing this building for 10 years. And when it became available, you know, I got that phone call from him and I said, Joe, what a great idea. He took the idea to the Board of uh, Trustees and of course the rest is history. Here we are now at the Shelby Township Activity Center. I think it's wonderful. Well, it means now residents have a lot more square footage to do a lot, many, many more activities than we had before. And um, it just means that we're well equipped. Our Parks and Recreation Department has a bigger menu of items for all of our residents to take part in. And that's what re really we're all about. It's about the quality of, of the services that we offer, and we're gonna be able to do a much, much better job now with this new uh, activity center. We're excited. And wait until you see the gym. Uh, we've got a games room. We've got, we're gonna be renting out a room for birthday parties. Uh, and with a birthday party, you're gonna be able to use a gym uh, for an extended uh, number of maybe an hour or two. There's just a lot of nice things happening. In the eight acres, that just goes on to, with all the other parks we have, well, now we have even more land. So we're excited. And now, Mr. Julio, what we got here from the guy who made all this happen. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Yes, uh, for the last five months, I've definitely been smiling every day. Having a facility like this for our Shelby Township uh, residents. And today, with the ribbon cutting, I think it smiles uh, a lot bigger. Uh, we had some board members that touched on the process here. So over the last few years, Township Board, they realized we needed a new activity center. So we're looking at building new. We're looking at almost $7 million. So with that being said, 
we one day came across this building was being for sale. So we looked into it. Shelby Township, thanks to the Township Board, approved the purchase for $2.25 million and a $1.5 million in renovation. So 3.75, it's on eight acres also. So before you leave today, take a look in the backyard. As I call it, the backyard It's beautiful. So we got baseball fields, soccer fields, something to be very proud of. So I'd really like to thank Shelby Township board members for supporting this. Our staff, senior staff, Parks and Rec members, all sitting over there on our lovely new seats. And a special thanks to uh, Cindy Martell, who's from day one has worked extremely hard in this whole process. So thank you. Thanks to all AEW, as you met over there. Anna, interior designer, very important, thank you. So appreciate it. And all the Shelby Township residents, we cannot wait to see them come here. Because I know they'll be smiling just like we are. Great facility. Thank you, Shelby Township board members. Okay, now, now let me tell you the rest of the story. I, I, when I was elected in 2008, this guy right here had an idea. But it wasn't, it, it was really a vision. This is just not a new idea here. This is really a vision. And he had his eye on this building for about 10 years. So when it came up, it wasn't a surprise when he walked in my office and when he told all of us, hey, we need to do this. So um, oh, you've got you. an eye for vision <laughs> and it's a great idea. And I just want to say on behalf of everybody here in Shelby Township, thank you very much, Joe Young. Great job. Present arms. Order arm. Ready to rest. That concludes the ceremony for raising the flag for the United States of America. It shall be township here at the new facility. Thank you very much. Oh, this means a great deal to the community. They've been working and trying to do a lot of different programs and projects in a tiny little space. So we've got this brand new facility for them. I know it'll bring a smile to everybody. A lot more people will probably participate in it. We've got a lot of programs. Joe Youngblood and his team have been doing a great job. All of our entire board is supportive of this. So we're really excited this happened. Probably uh, is a year and a half earlier than it would have taken place if we would have built it from scratch. We saved a lot of money. This project cost about $3.75 million to complete. Um, but it turned something that could have been uh, a blighted project in the community, an empty building, into a beautiful space for everyone to enjoy. So we're really glad it's here and we're really glad it's opening up. The place is fantastic. I can remember, this was one of my first projects that I had to undertake as a trustee. So I was nervous and I was really excited to be part of it. And the day that we walked into this building, I was like, oh boy, it's dirty, it's dingy, it needs a facelift. 
but we need an activity center. So we, Joe, again, and his team took this over. They, they participated it a lot. They painted it themselves to help out with the costs. Um, and it's just gorgeous from the chairs to the facility to the lighting to the new equipment um, They're really going to do a great job here for everyone And I know the township is going to really be excited to participate in this All right, let's take a look at the Shelby Township Activity Center. All right, we're going in How cool that looks. Senior Center. See, there's still touches from the old Senior Center here, all right? Because they always did that with the old center, too. Wow. Look at this brand new for the employees. So you can get all this information. This is a little behind the scenes look. Look at how great this looks. I mean, if you saw their old where they were working before, they were all pretty cramped into two little spaces, so this looks pretty good. And now let's head over to the Parks and Rec side. Hi! This looks great! Thank you! Big offices! Oh, that was in the old senior center. We still got the same pictures and painting. Here's the gym. And this is that little room. They named it the works room. And Andrew, if I'm not mistaken, that was the old Shelby, the Boys and Girls Club's name, right? So they named this the works room for the old uh, Boys and Girls Club. And this is, look at this yoga studio. This is huge. And it was a room that nobody really knew what to do with. So it looks really good. They've got some speakers up there some ping pong. This is gonna be really cool for birthday parties. A really, really cool space. All right, look at this gym. They've got the pickleball courts. And there's actually lines for pickleball. So you don't have to worry about that. Volleyball courts. Everything's padded. I think the last time we were here that we talked to Joe for the Living uh, in Shelby Township show, the pads were not up. <laughs> and it didn't look this good. I mean, this looks amazing. And last time we talked to Joe, he talked about the brand new chairs that they were getting for it. And he's right, they are very cool. So if you wanna watch, if you're not much of a sports player, sit on these really comfy chairs. Ooh, they are very comfortable. We're ready to rock. <laughs> Oh, you can buy them too. They're up for sale. And they do have the kitchen, which will be open soon. <laughs> this is room one. So this is like the lounge area. Again, the comfy couches, and look at that massive television. This is where we need to do movie night. We've got some books and magazines. The coffee is being poured. I'm ready. I'm ready for a cup of coffee and a movie. This is room two, another activity room. And look at these massive TVs again. I mean, this is pretty nice. Oh, so we can play. I've never played a video game in my life, but. Here's room 
four. Here's the computer room. This looks great. And these are state-of-the-art computers. Oh. And they've got the Shelby Township Nature Center here. I am not touching that. <laughs> All right, and this is another game room. They've got everything from a pool table to a ping pong table, we think, with nets. So maybe it doesn't... Yeah, the ball doesn't... We, Tyler and I tried it a little. The ball, it does hop very nicely, but I think with ping pong, it's a little bit... Ping pong is a little bit more difficult. Smaller ball, it moves quick. This is, I think, a little easier, which is very cool. Uh, foosball. This is now, I call this shuffleboard, like table shuffleboard. You ready? I think you want to get to the three, but not go off. Oh, one more. It's rigged. <laughs> it's rigged. <laughs> We've got more office space and the craft room. I mean, this is so cool. And that brings us back to the big great room. There's still a little bit of coziness here with the couches and the fireplace. And these tables will stay here. I mean, this is going to be for everyone. And I think a really cool feature too is the piano in the corner. I mean, how cool is that? I don't know how to play anything but one Christmas song, but I'm sure someone knows how to play better than me. <laughs> and donuts. <laughs> All right, well, that is it for our grand opening, but I want you to take a look. There are so many people here that the parking lot is full and across the street, they have to have police come block off the entrance because people have to now park on the other side and walk over. I mean, this has been a very, very successful grand opening. And if you want more information about how you can come and participate in the activities, just come to hang out, you can go to shelbytwp.org. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.